Hi hey guys, Lee H here, aka Criterium Racer, coming back with another video. For those of you um, new to my channel, I have very little production value whatsoever. And what I do on my channel is I open mail up of my pickups for the week. I collect um, a lot of non-sports cards, oddities, stuff like that, especially vintage. And also um, baseball. Um, usually vintage. Eddie Matthews is one of my best, um, my favorite players, PC guys. And we got a bat relic from him. Let's get on to the next mail. Um, yeah. So I also do also once in a great while, I do keep track of my ultra modern stuff just to open it up, see what it is. But my bread and butter is non-sports and vintage. And we got another pack here. Ooh. So. For the non-sport, I'm a big pack collector. And this is a Robocop 2. And you're going, what is special about this? Besides the massive piece of gum. And that is in cellophane. Well, this comes from Regina. Regina is made in Australia and New Zealand. Kind of licensed from Topps Company. Real hard to find in the States. So when I pick these up for 5 bucks ship, I got to pick it up. To add to my non-sport um, pack collection. Rarities and oddities. A lot of times, you know, on eBay... The packs may cost five, six dollars. However, the shipping to get them back over here will cost you a good uh, fifteen dollars. So when I saw that pop up, I'm really excited to add to my collection. Ooh, and speaking of non-sport cars, we got Ernie Hudson autograph card right down there. Very nice to add to my '80s. Oddball, I don't know, autograph collection, pop culture, 80s, you know, guys. That Ernie Hudson is a great pickup for my PC collection. And I also do autographs. I forgot to mention that. I'm going to open this big envelope off of packs. This goes, whoop, shite, shite, sir. I just went skiing today, so I'm a little bit tired here. And we got a rack pack. <clears throat> Starting to do a little bit more of that because I'm running out. Of, oh, this is painful. <sighs> um, running out of packs to get that aren't are 50 bucks and under. We got a Return of the Jedi with Han Solo in there. Um, great condition here. Yeah, it was better condition. He must have had a couple of them. And he put a bad one on there because uh, it was crinkled up up here. But a Return of the Jedi, great little addition. I'm a Star Wars guy, not a Trekkie. And let's open up one more envelope off of here. You hear me ripping? And we got another rack pack of gear. Sorry for that camera knock. I try to post once a week. And I have for the last couple, two years now. So, but ah. well, so, yeah. So I put out quite a bit of content, not a ton compared to some people. We got a Masters of the Universe um, rack pack. These bad boys are almost the same price as a normal pack, believe it or not, for some reason. But I didn't have one in my collection. Both of these are non-punched rack packs. Well, that's going to pick up this week's of cards and oddities and stuff like that. I always appreciate you guys stopping in, checking out my channel. Um... Until next time, guys, we'll catch you later. Sorry for the little short video. Also, go check out Semi Thunder's thousand um, uh, video, sub video giveaway. Uh, I got to make one for him. We'll talk to you later.